What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So today I'm doing a sketchbook uh, tour. This is one of uh, my many sketchbooks but this one's fully filled. I'm just uh, gonna browse through it. I hope you guys enjoy this video. So what I usually do in sketchbooks is just uh, try out uh, different characters or familiar characters like uh, a Darth Vader here. I never really know what I'm going to draw in my sketchbook. I usually just start out with a, a circle, a bit of a human like face, and then I'm going to I'll work it out. And if I really want to practice something, I'll practice it uh, multiple times or digitally. My sketchbook is just to keep me loose if I'm rusty. And I can look back at the, uh, what I was doing at that time. I really love seeing the progress of uh, the time before. So this was on New Year's Day, 1st of January 2016, so that's almost... A year ago, but yeah, <laughs> this is a bit how I felt when the new year started. It's everyone celebrated, but it's not really a big party or something. Some fun dinosaur like uh, monster. Just the eye. I don't know. I really love this one. It really turned it turned out well. I love the proportions of his face. He is a mad scientist. So I plan that on doing every a sketch every day, at least in the first month. And I uh, filled this whole sketchbook in just that month. So I'm really happy with that. But well, I'm too busy doing other stuff right now. Well, here's a mad scientist. I was doing. I think I made this sketch uh, during physics class, and I ended up coloring it in uh, after later on. I really love the uh, part, uh, the different glass uh, parts and things. I really. Uh, like the highlights, especially in this part where it really turned out well. <laughs> the Octo Cyborg Butler. So this was before, long before Archie Games came out from uh, Draw with Jezza. And I always loved drawing random things. And I started out with drawing this bubble of with a octopus in, octopus in it and I it turned out to be a butler uh, cyborg uh, uh, from uh, with an octopus inside of his head it truly looks like he's planning something evil but <laughs> he's serving sushi <laughs> this is some great character design of you maybe I'll do something later on with this some Batman hanging uh, upside down. Love the colors of the cape here. But as you can see, nothing is really refined here. Oh well, these some things are more refined than others. When I really uh, like how something turn out, turns out, I'll refine it for further on. But most of the time, I'll just keep it in my sketchbook. And this is. Uh, well, I was really bored at the time, and uh, the time was just going so slow. Sometimes, most of the time, I'll, I'm drawing in class, and when I get, especially when I'm when I get bored, and then I'll just end up drawing things like this, and then end up uh, making it refined, like the uh, here with color at home more so we're already at day seven 
it's, I believe it's 7th of January. And this is a waitress, a little bit of a fat waitress. <laughs> the proportions are horrible. As you can see, this arm, this arm here is just... Well, it's, it's shorter than this arm and the, the torso is just terrible. The, the butt is just... Oh, uh, I'm able to do it better than now. I'm still not good at it though. I always have to struggle with drawing women. But I'm trying to practice it as much as I can. But it's still one of my weak points. So ice hockey. You've got mail! <laughs> this is uh, yeah, a mailman. I believe. I'm not sure. I, I received a very important email that day. I'm not sure what it was about. But it was something. I drew this because of that email. I'm not sure what it was about. It was something I was very happy about. So the, this was at the barber shop. I really drew. So this kid was sitting at the barber, and he was just looking at me while his hair was being cut, and was just fascinated about uh, uh, the. Uh, about me I believe he was just looking at me with this happy face and I was I felt really awkward because I was drawing him and he I believe he did not notice it but yeah <laughs> it's a very very happy kid it's very funny he's a weird fish drinking some tea with uh, very big lips lovely color lovely color again yeah Whoa, this is uh, something you, uh, I didn't don't know what I was thinking at that time, but uh, this is uh, something. <laughs> oh, this is, I was, uh, this was at, um, I was thinking about like a Starbucks and uh, how people uh, write the write stories or writers write their stories in while they're uh, drinking Starbucks uh, doing using their MacBook etc and I wanted to draw this character who was uh, making his own story on <laughs> on this iMac and uh, he's just yeah, he's a bit of a monster, a bit of a minotaur kind of feel. I love the mouth though. The muscles are a little bit weird. Lighting is out of place, but I love the, I love the mouth. Some figures, uh, figure sketching. I love drawing ballerinas. They're so elegant, and the positions are quite hard to draw. So, some, some from time to time, I'm just draw some ballerinas. Here's a, an ugly uh, princess. Yeah, let's just skip that one. <laughs> this is a, a, a very happy singer with a huge forehead. He's uh, clearly looking at someone. I always love when uh, one of my characters turn out to have their own personality. You can clearly see just from his face what uh, this man is thinking. He's just like singing, walking around with his weird suitcase and just smiling and looking very, very, yeah. He's it looks like it looks like it looks like he's uh, seducing someone or something. I really, it's just really funny. Here we have some dogs, I believe. Yeah, different kind of dogs. There's a dog here. Yeah. Really love this bulldog. Pretty funny. Again, very bad proportions. Oh, this is. Uh, so this is like a lake in the park near my house. 
it was winter no it yes it was winter at the time and it was uh, very um everything was really bluish even the grass and the water it, re it was reflecting everything perfectly and i really uh, wanted to draw that picture i took a photo i believe really cool well ugly woman again she was smoking don't uh, don't look at the hands oh this is uh, I really, this is cool some kind of voodoo voodoo doll yeah this turned out very well I really like this and this is uh, with some kind of paint poodle dog day 18 day 16 oh, this <gasps> Very interesting. And yeah, uh, like a hell's angel, he just he's just sitting on a bench in the park, minding his own business. Good times. Good times. Some frogs. So first, I drew this uh, draw frog from a uh, picture. And I wanted to cartoon uh, it up, and I drew, I drew this frog after, and it, it, oh, it turned out so bad. It, it really looks like I drew a penis right here in in his mouth. It's it's something weird, but I really like this one. It's like uh, this one. I like his face, his look. He really looks as if he doesn't care about anything, he's just sitting there. And this is the penis face, penis face uh, frog. <laughs> and just from reference. Well, yeah. Let's just move on. We've got a blacksmith kid, like a girl with some nice ponytail, making a sword on an anvil. It's a little bit black, but I believe I want to, I wanted to uh, give the lighting from the fire uh, a little bit more, uh, a little bit more attention in the whole picture. So I just made this very white here, and everything around very dark. I, I could have made the more difference in shadows. Oh, I love the mask here, especially. Here's some Harley Quinn. So this was end of January, begin February, and they just really, they released the first uh, trailer for Suicide Squad. And oh man, I remember thinking and seeing that trailer and being amazed and excited for the movie. Turned out to be a little bit of a disappointment, but still a good drawing. I love the face and the hair. Deep. Again, proportions could be better. This arm is a little bit fat. This arm is a little bit weird. Very small. But if you just look at the face, it's just. It's okay. <laughs> could be better. Here we've got Papa John's, I believe. It's just uh, a guy serving a turkey. Again, don't look at the hand. Nothing interesting. This is like, uh, I drew this, oh, I drew this uh, during chemistry and the teacher told me that it uh, looks very good. I was pretty proud of this one at the time, but looking at this, it's, uh, it's only like a half year ago and I, it's so, <laughs> I'm not satisfied with how it looks. Especially when you when you compare it to what I draw now, I'm more I practice with much more on that at the moment, and you just you just see the weak spots like this lag is just way too long. This lag is so small, it's, it doesn't really fit. I was just playing with uh, 3D a bit. I wanted to pop pop out a bit more, and, and it worked.
So here we've got a cat in space. Not so happy with the whole background, but happy with this hand. Oh, well, just huh. this is uh, retarded me, I believe. With uh, some ponytails, looking very into very uh, intelligent. I don't think you uh, can talk much with this uh, guy. This is just not a finished piece. Awesome, awesome, Deadpool. Yeah, Deadpool just came out, it was really cool. And uh, I believe that's it. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video and want to see more, consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any suggestions for the next video, leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.